C88. Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to Portal 2. My name is Zeros88 and today we are continuing our uh, time race, I don't know if that's how it's called, against Wheatley and his dumb uh, desire to destroy Aperture Science and explode everything without, without him actually wanting to, just because he's a complete idiot and he doesn't know what he's doing. So we're trying to remove him from Gladys' uh, previous body and for Gladys to take control once again of Aperture Science. The deal is if I help her, well, if we help her uh, to get on her previous place, uh, she will finally let us leave this time for sure, apparently. And yeah, uh, Whitley has a surprise for us, which is the third surprise in this game. And both uh, the, the the previous two uh, haven't been like quite a pleasant surprise, to be honest. So. <laughs> okay. So we have to time this. Surprise! Oh. We're doing it now. Oh! Okay. Credit where it's due. For a little idiot built specifically to come up with stupid, unworkable plans, that was a pretty well laid trap. <laughs> you probably figured it out by now, but I don't need you anymore. I found two little robots back here built specifically for testing. Oh no. He found a cooperative testing initiative. It's something I came up with to phase out human testing just before you escaped. It wasn't anything personal, just, you know, you did kill me. There's fair. I guess this is the part where he kills us. Rainway. There I was, smashing some steel plates together, and I thought to myself, yeah, it's deadly, but what's missing? What's missing? And I thought lots of sharp bits welded onto the flight bits. It's still a work in progress, don't judge me yet. Um, but, you know, eventually, I'd like to get them to, to sort of... No, 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 don't do that. Don't, stand right here, stand... Start machine. Oh, he actually kills us if I don't do anything. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> I thought he was going to like come back and uh, talk to us a little bit more. Okay, again, first fair. Hello, this is the part where I kill you. And this was the part where he actually killed us. So there I was, smashing some steel plates together, and I thought to myself, "Yeah, no, 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 don't do that. Stand right here. Stand. Where'd you go? Come back. Come yep, back. Yep, let's run." No, seriously, do come back, please. Come back, please. <laughs> okay, look, I've decided I'm not gonna kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends, good old friends, not enemies. And I would say something like, come back, and you'd be like, yeah, no problem, and you'd come back. What happened to those days? Um. I think that's it. Ugh. You can't help but notice that you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea. Oh, little pot. Yes, oh, yes, Jesus. In your face, I got armor. Fine, let the games begin. Um. Uh, no, uh, uh, I was trying to place one of the portals uh, on the wall. I didn't realize it was like a little bit more difficult than that. What happened to those days? You can't help but notice that you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea! Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor! Fine, let the games begin. It's just, I don't think I can actually jump. Oh, I'm an idiot. Ooh, that was quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm almost there. Ah. Don't 
Jesus Christ, this guy. Oh, good. Guess what? They're all full houses. Never actually played cards, meaning to learn. Anyway, new turret, not defective. Ace of fours, best hand. Unbeatable, oh, I would imagine. <laughs> um. Okay, turret's gone. Oh, and we actually have to go through. Okay, okay, okay. Well. Oh, I see. Clever. Very clever. And foolish. Spinny blade wall. Machiavellian. No. Oh. Well. <laughs> good, good. Finally, a nemesis worthy of my vast intellect. I mean, I guess I do have to go through here. Holmes versus Moriarty. <laughs> Aristotle versus Mashy Spike Plate. <laughs> yeah, sure. Stay still, please. Nope. All right, stop moving. Nope. Oh, almost got you there, almost got you there. Nope. Oh, good. What? Jeez. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come back, come back! Oh my god. Did something break back there? Oh, oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed uh, you. Oh, I should have, like, uh, jumped in that place and gained momentum, maybe? I don't know. Oh, okay, jail. Did something break back there? Kinda. Oh, oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed you. Hello? Oh shit, no! Oh, 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 Jesus yes, Christ. Right, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back if you're still alive. I don't know how to cross that place. Did something break back there? Oh, oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed you. Hello? Oh, 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 yes, all right, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back. If you're still alive, I'm gonna be back. Don't die until I get back. Yeah, there we go. Whoa, whoa, those are a ton. A ton of turrets. What can we do? Is there an actual base where I can land on there?
Okay. Over here. Over there. <laughs> I'm so sorry over there. Oof. <laughs> They're just flying like... Oh man, you saw that? So sorry about them. There we go. Okay, that's all of them. Now what? going we keep going and non stopping crashing's too good for him first he'll spend a year in the incinerator year two cryogenic refrigeration wing then 10 years in the chamber i built where all the robots scream at you then i'll kill him At least Gladys is uh, redirecting her hatred towards someone else, not me. Which is a nice change. <laughs> okay, so let's see. What does this do? Okay. Okay. Oh, those are explosives. Okay. But wait, how do we... Oh, there's actually broken... Oh, I didn't see that. I thought it was like the full... Okay, 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 sorry, sorry. So, here. And then here, maybe? So we can destroy this thing. Down. Wait, why? Okay. And now what? Spaces. Some orange gel. have been a bit of a failure so far for both of us, I think you'll agree, and you are getting very close to my lair. Lair, it's weird that first time I said that, it sounds a bit, it sounds a bit ridiculous really, but uh, I can assure you it is one, it is a proper lair, deadly lair, and uh, I just wanted to give you the chance to kill yourself now, before you get to the lair. Uh, just jump into that masher, just there. Uh, less a death trap, more a death option for you. Sounds crazy, but hear me out, hear me out. Once you get to my lair, death will not be optional, all right? It will be mandatory. No tricks, no surprises, just you dying as a result of me killing you in a very, very gruesome way. So, book better offer here is just kill yourself. You know, it seems a lot of effort, isn't it, walking all the way to my deadly lair, where there's a perfectly serviceable death option right there. Again, not a death trap, not a death trap. Your death would be entirely voluntary. And very much appreciated. The masher does work, I should point out as well. I know we've had a couple of problems um, 
in the past. This smash definitely works and it will kill you. Um, if that's one of your concerns about not jumping in, uh, the, the masher will kill you straight away, painless. Well, it won't be painless, obviously, but um, it, will, it will mash you up. In summary, walk all the way to certain doom. Okay, I'll take that as a no then. <laughs> That's a, that's actually a great question. Jesus Christ. And well, I guess we'll know the answer soon enough. Um, so yeah, I guess that's it for today's episode, guys. A little bit of a shorter one, but I think we're actually going to fight Wheatley on the next episode. So yeah. I really hope you guys are enjoying, and if you are, please consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing to my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya!